For decades, Voyager 1 has been our steadfast ambassador, journeying into the unknown and transmitting data that has reshaped our understanding of the cosmos. But something extraordinary happened on November 14th, 2023. Out of nowhere, Voyager 1 went silent. Instead of its usual steady stream of scientific data, it began sending back what appeared to be nothing but meaningless binary code, a chaotic jumble that left NASA engineers baffled. Was this simply a technical malfunction, or had Voyager 1 stumbled upon something it was never meant to encounter? For five agonizing months, NASA's team at the Jet Propulsion Laboratory struggled to re-establish contact with the venerable spacecraft. Then, in a stunning turn of events, Voyager 1 reappeared in April 2024. Its initial transmissions were normal telemetry, confirming that the spacecraft was indeed functional. But what came next sent shockwaves through the scientific community. A mysterious signal, an anomaly emerging at the very edge of the solar system, and data that utterly defied our existing models of the universe. So what exactly did Voyager 1 discover beyond the heliopause, the boundary where the sun's influence fades and interstellar space begins? And why is NASA keeping so many details under wraps? The answer might just change everything we thought we knew about space exploration. Initially, NASA's engineers suspected that Voyager 1's sudden outburst of garbled data was due to a failure in its flight data system, FDS a critical onboard computer component responsible for processing and transmitting vital information. A memory failure in the FDS would mean that the spacecraft could no longer process its surroundings or send back coherent data. In a desperate bid to salvage the mission, engineers devised a daring plan. Reassign the FDS code to another section of the probe's memory. A risky move given that every command to Voyager takes over 22.5 hours to travel one way. Then, on April 18th, 2024, the team sent the final reprogramming command. For two long days, silence reigned. And then, on April 20th, the impossible happened. Voyager 1 responded. It was alive, and its first packets of data looked normal. But soon after, something strange began to emerge. Voyager 1 detected an anomaly beyond the heliopause, a turbulent region where the solar wind gives way to the interstellar medium. Instead of the smooth, gradual fading of the sun's influence we expected, the heliopause appeared to be fluctuating violently, expanding and contracting in ways that defied our theoretical models. Even more unsettling, the data revealed a sudden increase in particle density, up to 10 times higher than predicted. Where was this extra energy coming from? And buried within the influx of numbers was a repeating low-frequency hum at 3 kilohertz, consistent over nearly three years. Initially dismissed as a byproduct of interstellar plasma waves, this signal refused to fade or vary with solar activity. Its persistent nature hinted at deliberate structure, almost as if it were a beacon a communication, or perhaps even a warning. This discovery has led scientists to consider three major theories. One, an external intelligence might be intercepting Voyager 1's signals and embedding its own message into the data stream. Two, a dormant program might have been triggered within Voyager's own systems once it entered deep interstellar space. And three, Perhaps most provocatively, Voyager 1 has encountered something in interstellar space, a force field, or even an advanced civilization, using the probe as a communication relay. None of these theories fit neatly into our current understanding, and each raises profound questions about what lies beyond our solar system. The implications become even more staggering when we consider the engineering behind Voyager 1. The spacecraft's communication system employs robust error-correcting codes and redundant memory systems. Yet the recent anomalies suggest that something entirely unexpected is at play. 
The chaotic data that once appeared as mere static was later processed using the revolutionary Majorana 1 quantum computing chip. Unlike traditional computers, this quantum system can analyze millions of potential data relationships simultaneously, revealing hidden geometric patterns and precise mathematical sequences within what seemed like random noise. When scientists applied this quantum analysis, a repeating 127-bit sequence emerged, a series of prime numbers and mathematical constants that, when mapped out, formed complex, three-dimensional spiral structures with embedded symbols. These aren't artifacts of old programming. They're deliberate, structured signals. Statistical analysis suggests the probability of such patterns arising naturally is less than one in one million, essentially impossible under normal circumstances. NASA's public statements remain cautious. Officially, the agency attributes the anomalous data to natural cosmic phenomena. However, internal debates and international collaborations tell a different story. Behind closed doors, quantum physicists and SETI researchers are locked in heated discussions. Some experts are even calling for an immediate, coordinated international response. Agencies such as the European Space Agency, China's CNSA, and Russia's Roscosmos are now pooling resources to independently verify these findings. Recent steps include the activation of backup communication channels on Voyager 1, new isolation protocols on the Deep Space Network to rule out terrestrial interference, and the retroactive application of quantum pattern recognition algorithms to archival data from Pioneer, Galileo, and Cassini missions. All of these efforts aim to determine if this mysterious signal is unique to Voyager 1, or if similar hidden messages have been hiding in plain sight all along. The philosophical implications of this discovery are as profound as the scientific ones. If the message is indeed evidence of non-human intelligence interacting with our technology, it would represent the first confirmed contact of its kind a communication not initiated by Earth, but one that has somehow latched onto our oldest interstellar messenger. Such a breakthrough would challenge the very foundations of SETI, shifting its focus from passive listening to analyzing the responses of our own space assets. The decoded message itself contains elements that suggest a deep understanding of our physical constants, but with subtle variations. It hints at coordinates, a language of numbers and geometry that might be guiding us to something or someone beyond our current comprehension. Imagine a beacon, a cosmic handshake from an intelligence that has been watching our progress for decades. As of now, verification teams are working around the clock. The International Consortium expects preliminary results within 60 days, with a complete mathematical interpretation of the message potentially finalized within 90 days. The ultimate goal is to establish a two-way communication protocol within 120 days, should the signal persist and its authenticity be confirmed. This is more than just a technical anomaly, it's a potential paradigm shift. Whether the source of the signal is an advanced civilization, a previously unknown cosmic phenomenon, or an unforeseen byproduct of interstellar space, the discovery is already challenging our understanding of the universe. Renowned figures like Neil deGrasse Tyson have called this the most significant moment in human scientific history, cautioning us to remain open-minded while emphasizing the transformative potential of quantum computing in revealing hidden truths. So, what do you think? Is Voyager 1's mysterious message simply a cosmic fluke? Or have we just uncovered evidence of a profound, possibly intelligent presence lurking at the edge of our solar system? Drop your thoughts and theories in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell for more updates on this unfolding cosmic mystery. Thank you for joining us on this incredible journey into the unknown. The universe is vast, mysterious, and full of surprises and we're here to uncover every single one.